Okay, who keeps leaving their body parts around like this? Hmm. Always remember to clean up after yourself. Still, if no one's using this torso, let's have some fun. Sure, we can add a leg, an arm, but let's get creative. Add another torso, and another, and another. Still, probably should add at least one head. Now let's take our creation out for a spin. <laughs> Want to know what's really scary? What's in these hot dogs? And that's why I'm a mustard kind of guy. Don't worry, our Ken doll will help us get ahead. <laughs> our hot dogs have ketchup and Ken learned to avoid high altitudes. Ew, gross! Who eats hot dogs without the bun? Mmm, mm, juicy. But I'm a little nervous about that apple it came from. Besides, we can make our own worms. Just fill a container with straws and add a drink. Stick it inside the freezer. Give it time to solidify. Take out a straw and start squeezing away. Probably should make a bunch in case you want to go fishing. They're so nice and stretchy and they probably feel all gooey. You know what they say, the early bird and all that. How could they let kids play with something so scary? Well, this seems more family friendly. And look, he stretches. Kind of makes you wonder what's inside this guy. Let's make a slight incision. It's experiment time. <laughs> we can turn him into a giant water balloon. And now he's our brand new centerpiece. Water just really feels like his element, doesn't it? Well, this seems interesting, but what does it do exactly? Oh, it looks like we have company. Guess this ghost hasn't worked out the whole intangibility thing. Good, that just means it can pick up the snacks. Don't forget something to wash it down with. My, aren't we grabby today? <sighs> Trick or treat! Aw, who can say no to that face? So, what can we do with this jar of juice? Well, here's the next best thing. Add a really wide photo. Let it go for a spin. Stretch it out, and it looks like someone's inside. Mm. Who would have guessed that mm. preparing was such thirsty work? Dressing like it's always Halloween sure comes in handy on Halloween. But our furry friend here could use some help. Oh, I guess someone doesn't want to be Spider Dog. How's about a cowboy costume, little doggy? Can't forget the hat, makes the whole costume. Is this dog picky, or are there just a bunch of them? Be a little gargoyle with a pair of bat wings. Or maybe a hot dog. Ha! The jokes write themselves. Oh, there really were four. It's like our own little Halloween party. Good morning, dear. Oh, right, it's night. Time to brush those teeth. Hmm. Needs a little something. Always want your canines to look their best. <laughs> Let's try them out. Ooh, won't need that whole punch anymore. Yeah, he's really in the mood for something red. And even the undead can't help but love instant noodles. 
Ooh. This one even comes with toppings. <laughs> Fancy! Something fun can be right at your fingertips. Like this glove. Fill it with some red juice. Yes, juice. Now it just needs a little temperature control. Unwrap, and soon you'll have a whole candy hand. Experiment with flavors. Maybe add some toppings. Who doesn't like sweets to have a little crunch? You can make a mold out of so many things, even your ear. Just let the material harden, and you'll copy the whole shape. It's the perfect thing in case you want to make candy ears. After all, otherwise you've just got two to go around. Or you can keep them for yourself. He's no doctor, but he's dressing like one for Halloween. Is it me or is there something a little off about this teddy bear? Oh, that's just wrong. Black licorice? <laughs> Maybe Mr. Bear just needs some fresh fruit in his diet. Ooh, looks like someone dug up a date. Don't think the rap life's for him. But don't worry, this food wrap should keep him nice and fresh. Let's just hope there's enough to go around. Does he want to be a mummy or the Incredible Hulk? Oh, I see. He's just making his own better half. Probably should get some use out of these Christmas lights. Now we've got a brand new front yard decoration. And you've got your very own light show. A dove. Well, kind of off brand, but happy to have you. Because even the spooky are just Disney princesses deep down. Let's help our feathered friend feel at home. Two bins on top of each other make a perfect birdhouse. Just hang it up. Still needs a little something, like, you know, an opening? Time to fly on in. Uh, where is he anyway? Let me guess, you used to work for a magician. Who can say no to a free apartment? Oh, two doves. What's next, some French hens? Jack's getting ready. Oh no, a Halloween blackout. Wait, a Halloween blackout. This has possibilities. First, we'll need some melted wax. We can pour it inside this skull. Add a wick before it dries. And you've got a new candle. It's the perfect light for a Halloween night. Of course, it works better if you have a few. <laughs> Now Jack can finish with his touch-up. Don't be scared off by a little lightning. After all, it's really just electricity. Of course, this light bulb might have more fun, if it's got to be something else tonight. It's the whole point of Halloween. And now our new spiders can enjoy the party. But even without webs, they can make for a sticky situation. Time to get down and dance until it's November. Whoops, your skirt's all over that lamp. Actually, it's kind of a nice look. In fact, it's starting to look pretty familiar. Why, it's Cousin It! Time to dance the Mamushka! 
Happy Halloween, everyone, and catch you next time.